to us With our mouth bridging and collide such and guess it's all I don't know what would happen if I had a solo Doesn't. show. <laughs> a solo show. A solo show. I mean, Spaceman Nikolai is kind of a solo, but it's not really a show at all. I don't know. I feel like solo shows have to be either ed- like educational almost. Like the Saichi Boy Tom show? That wasn't it. That was just a night show for Saich. Yeah. But all of the like he, I don't know. Like the Saichi Boy Tom show would never happen with just him. Then he'd be, hey. Yeah, that's true. I got the family beer. Of Jamarcus. <laughs> Jamarcus. I got beer and a plan. There's a lot of good edit, like, editing room floor of uh, just me and Seich yelling at each other <laughs> during the. Uh... <laughs> which uh, during which one? During um uh, the oh shit. Besides so boy, tell him show. When I was his band leader, Jamarcus. Or oh Jamarcus. yeah, Jamarcus. I would change. I would change the uh, band leader's name every time. <laughs> oh, there was the I. Did, were you there when I did the guy who just left everything he that Sage said? Jamarcus. No, I, I didn't. I, I did, didn't see you. I did a really obnoxious laugh. I did something. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> but like every single thing that he would say. <laughs> what are you going on there, boy? <laughs> Marcus, I like it. I remember hearing the name. I think yeah. I came like at the tail end of yeah. the recording sesh. <laughs> the recording sesh? Yeah, that's what the term we use in the biz. <clears throat> yeah. Wait, you came? <laughs> All over those mics. <laughs> I, I like, I, sh- I showed up. Oh my god, I remember that. <laughs> you were there. You I were, was there. You were in the room, you were recording. I was like, you were behind the camera. What? <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember the tales of Jamarcus? Uh, yes, I do remember. I think he's lying. I don't think there's a chance in hell he remembers that. I remember Jamarcus. I mean, there was a couple other... Because uh, we changed it every episode. There's only one ep- episode ever, though, I think. <laughs> that ever actually came out. We filmed four. <laughs> no, two came out. Did a second one ever come out? I think so. Two came out. I really don't one think one so. was... One, uh, the first one was, was you. Me, and then the second one was... was Yours didn't come out? Or no, not? we filmed mine twice, and both times <laughs> <laughs> something happened. And then we did uh, Al's, and then that we never finished. Stone Cold. Sorry, Stone Cold. it was... Uh, Stone Cold. Cro- it was uh, 3 minutes, 14 seconds. Oh. Yeah. I mean, that's close. Was it 316? 316. Damn. <laughs> Austin 314 says, don't park in my spot. <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't have the same ring to it, mostly because we know it's 316. Yeah. <laughs> that is a perfect dad joke to get it wrong. Listen to your kids, I don't know about your WWFs with your Austin 318s. <laughs> Alright, All right, like- Mr. Dwayne Rocks and your pebbles. Okay. <laughs> I think I think we found your new character. <laughs> it's gotcha. almost hip with it, Dad. <laughs> He sounds drunk, too. He's, yeah, I mean, well, he's hip. He's cool. He's, I mean, isn't it cool to drink, right? Yeah. Especially little, when you're rearing children. Yeah, a little too cool. Yeah. <laughs> you start talking about wrestling. That's when you know. Austin 318. Oh, man. Listen, Ooh. I'm a huge fan of as soon as possible, Rocky. He's got some good stuff. It's good. When, with you guys, with your Ninky Minjages <laughs> and your Cardinal it. Bs. I never get it. I tried. <laughs> when does, I, think it's, I think it's like the rum. I, it sounds like she's been having that a little bit of... You heard? <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. I love this character. Oh, oh, almost hip dad Nikolai <laughs> see the funny part is it's just me <laughs> it's just a father yeah, it's just me sitting there alone <laughs> talking about pop culture <laughs> like interviewing him like World War 2 they do to the World War 2 survivors like tell us what happened 
<laughs> my daughter. <laughs> my daughter. <laughs> but but like, it's this generation, so we just talk about hip hop. They're on the. Is that snap- what you're getting at? They're on the Snapchats. Listen, when I was little, growing up, listen to Half Dollar, talking about birthdays. <laughs> I just got it. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was a bad joke. That I'm was like... a great joke. What? <laughs> that was great. Oh, like a half dollar talking about birthdays. <laughs> oh, man. Little Go people. short person. It's uh, your birthday. <laughs> <laughs> I think. Oh, this. Oh, that was a pretty. <laughs> So oh, this oh, he pulled the racist record. No, no, oh, no, God. not racist, not racist. Okay, okay good. The, the first thing that went through my mind was that's the first song I figured a girl to. <laughs> what a <laughs> tremendous time! <laughs> Go no, shorty. It's, it's your, your birthday. birthday. <laughs> like that? Oh. oh. No. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> well, now I know what not to do. <laughs> As, all right. To be clear, she <laughs> she wasn't playing that song. Her brother was in the ro- his room upstairs. We were in the living room downstairs because you're not allowed to go in the bedrooms. Of course. I mean, <laughs> come on. <laughs> she might get fingers. <laughs> Instead of on the family couch. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Oh my god. Uh, well, I'm dead. I'm spent. <laughs> um So you were saying before that you would change something up on Twitter? Yeah, I did. What did. what did you do? So I gave it the old uh, switcheroo, and uh, I went, and instead of, normally on Twitter, I, I ask people for questions and we answer them. But this week I asked people a question and had them send in their answers. And uh, I have some of those right now. Wow. Oh, okay, wow. so you just, you went straight Jeopardy on them, essentially. I did. Because you gave the answer and you... <laughs> you just... <laughs> Oh my god, someone came in and broke chop Nikolai. <laughs> Holy shit. We're gonna have to find that guy. I think it was Seich. Oh, god. No, it's Tommy Gun. Tommy Gun? Yeah, he just came out of the closet real quick. It's like, <laughs> oh, you're not gonna have me sing first? <laughs> Hit me in the throat. <laughs> He's like, we, we start with comments. It's like, Thomas, no. <laughs> You guys couldn't hear it. We cut it out. Huh. Yeah. I mean, yeah it was dangerous. It was, it was for hard. For legal fun. reasons. Yeah, for legal reasons. <laughs> um. <laughs> so we have a song for Twitter. Why don't we play that? Yeah. <laughs> And I'm just thinking about Selena and Barnes. What? I don't know why. Actually, I do know why. Because one of my favorite jokes is that they just made it part of the bar exam. You have to identify which one is which. Which one is Selena? And which one is Barnes? It's so stupid. I don't even think people outside of this region get that commercial. I don't think so. <laughs> They're like try to stay mainly. You said the legal, and my head just went. Eight six six twenty twenty. Salido Epar. Do you need an entry attorney lawyer? I haven't had that since eighty three. <laughs> <laughs> um. So are we? Are gonna be funny for anyone else? <laughs> 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 you're gonna, you're gonna 
Dylan did this later and be like, I can't, I don't, I don't have anything. Who is Selena? <laughs> For that matter, who's Barnes? <laughs> Oh All right, so what are some of the answers you got on Twitter, Matt? Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, All right, well. Uh, <laughs> K-Rob. <laughs> K-Rob 1290. Rob, Crab, Rob, yeah. Crab. Crab says, uh, at all of YouTube, a remote explosive rubber duck, lock picks, and a silenced pistol. But it works like in video games and not how they really work in real life. <laughs> So he wants a video game based. I don't know what is the difference between a video game based silenced pistol and a a regular silenced pistol. Wait, so he wants um, these items in a video game? No. Oh no! I, did you these... not read the uh, the answer? Oh, I'm sorry. Yes, you, you did damn. not read the question. I didn't. I didn't read the question. Uh, for this to work, I kind of have to do that. Okay. <laughs> so for uh, uh, <laughs> the context of what Matt just read, uh, I asked, "What are the three things you would take with you?" If you had to navigate some sort of diehard-style hostage takeover. Oh. Okay. And Krob would take... And he wants us to debate sl- briefly the... Uh, um, the merits. The merits of a video game silencer pistol. And then... Oh. I, I would imagine the video game would have, like, unlimited bullets, right? No, no, no. Wait. <coughs> wait. Where did video he want, game... Come? Okay. So he it's says... what we're actually he, taking. He right? says a remote explosive rubber duck. That's okay. the first thing. Okay. Great. Lock picks. Great choice. And a silenced pistol, and then in parentheses he says, but it works like in video games and not how they really work in uh, real okay. life. Oh, okay. okay, gotcha, gotcha, okay. So, like, he doesn't know how to lockpick, but he can lockpick doors because it's a video. Okay, I gotcha. Well, no. He's, but he, he just wants set. it to apply to the pistol. Yeah. So, meaning, like, I, I don't know what that means. Maybe silenced pistols in video I, games no, are but, actually quiet. No, what that means is that he knows about guns and, can and that the portrayal of guns in video games and television isn't realistic to real life. And that for the purposes of this response, like he, can he wants us to picture guns in a video game. Gotcha. Okay. That makes more sense to me. And uh, that is a pretty great selection. I mean, what is he going to use the rubber duck for? Who, who, I mean, a who grenade. Isn't, who isn't he going to use a rubber duck? For? It's got to be a grenade. But it's only one. I would imagine he'd use the rubber duck. Ideally, you'd want to use it on the big boss's like Ooh. strongest muscle, right. not on the big boss himself. I mean, no. you, that's what the pistol and like the bare knuckles are for. That's, that's what true. hope is for, Matt. Yeah, absolutely. The final boss battle. It's true. <laughs> boss John battle. McClane, boss John McClane battle. didn't use the the C four on Hans Gruber. No. He used it on henchman number one did it, or two. Did I get that right? And just I mean, yeah. I, I mean I've seen that movie, so I should kinda of, I should know that, but I haven't seen Die Hard in a long time. Right. Thank you, Karab. Now, while you're looking up another response, what I would bring if it was a uh, Die Hard esque situation is um, I feel like a walkie-talkie radio because mm-hmm. uh, that just seems like the, they're always going to come in handy. Yeah, you know, just just bloop, I am part of the team. Like, what's the plan again? <laughs> <laughs> Go over it in detail, boss. And then you know, and with luck, you might meet a portly police officer on the outside. Absolutely, <laughs> with a lot of sass, but like just enough like hard work to get it in, and know how yeah. to get it done in the end. Um, what else? Oh, an extra pair of sh- uh, shoes. Mm. Ooh. Nice like shoes or like... shoes. Okay, tennis <laughs> shoes, light shoes. Very nice. I'm literally I'm just thinking of different scenes from Die Hard that I would want to like... Now you have, he has tennis shoes on now. Yeah. <laughs> He's just walking on the glass. This yeah. is fun. And uh, a hatchet. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Nice. The hatchet's nice, but I don't know, man. I... I feel like I would chicken out of actually hitting somebody with the hatchet. Oh, yeah. I mean, like that's ugh. for doors. <laughs> I'm not going to kill anybody. That's crazy. I mean, if someone comes at you in a I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to hit him with not, a hatchet. At any point, I haven't said I'm, I'm still me. 
It's true. <laughs> just it's over. It's like, oh, ooh, ooh, no, ooh. no. Hey, <laughs> look at these <laughs> shoes. <laughs> I got a radio and part of the team. No, mine's the wrong color. I get it. <laughs> I'm cut. I am cut. <laughs> We don't use radio, we use Snapchat. <laughs> oh, okay. Wow. <laughs> We're mean, a very progressive hostage takeover group. I, yeah, I mean, I got to imagine that most younger kids don't even use Snapchat anymore, but... Exactly. I'll shut up. I'll shut up. Yes, do that. <laughs> um, trying to... So, do you have another response on uh, Twitter? Uh, I do, I do. Dr. Mr. Pepper. Wow. Dr. Mr. Okay. Pepper. Dr. Mr. Pepper says... Uh, he would bring a bottle of vodka, okay, his phone, mm-hmm. and some matches. Don't get the matches. I think somebody's planning on starting a fire. Probably. Maybe the With fire. The vodka? Maybe turn in the sprinklers. If it's on. high enough proof. Ooh, yeah, they make uh, Molotov cocktails. Hmm. What are you going to do with the matches, though? St- uh, you light the uh, handkerchief up and then you throw Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, that's what the vodka was for. <laughs> I uh, I don't think I, I, <laughs> I tried that joke three times. I'm sorry. Right on my face. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't get I don't get what the uh, the what, what was it? It was a bottle of vodka. His phone. Okay. It was a bottle of vodka. His phone and uh, the matches. The phone uh, there, I, I guess, is just to to kind of call somebody on the outside. Well, the phone is the only real tool. I mean, the vodka's for fun. The but matches, it... I don't I don't even know what he would really do with those, and the phone is the real tool. But, I mean, I, I don't know. I feel it's like, like you call like... people, you play some jumpy fish. I don't know what the kids do these days. The jumpy fish. Yeah. Get me to get some jumpers. No, to make a Molotov cocktail, you open it, you put the handkerchief Molotov. in. Molotov. Yeah. And then you light it up. Yeah. Yeah. You so I'm talking it. about the phone. You forgot to talk. You forgot the part where you fill the bottle with Molotov. <laughs> <laughs> you just got to fill it right up. Yeah. And yeah. Then, and when then the, that's how you make a Molotov cocktail. Right? Yeah, yeah. You put Molotov. And then you liquor. drink it. You drink Can it. Can you imagine if somebody was like, if they didn't know, like they'd only ever heard of Molotov cocktail. Right. But they didn't know that like that meant it was a mixture of things, and thought that Molotov was a thing. Right. That was just. Oh yeah! I gotta get revenge. We need to get some Molotov. What? <laughs> I need all the Molotov you have. What? What is that? <laughs> <laughs> First and foremost, no. Yeah. <laughs> no. There's only one thing with that name. Yeah. <laughs> and I don't want anything to do with that thing. <laughs> um. What would you bring in a diehard yeah, well, situation? Um. Uh, my cats. Mm-hmm. Uh, They're very useful. Yeah, I I um I have a bunch of uh, leashes connected to my chest, mm-hmm. and they're all connected. And then when a firefight breaks out, I let them loose. Oh, and they have uh retractable blades that come out of their. They have rings on their body, and blades come out of them, and they cut the bad guys down. Okay, wow. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna count that Whoa. as all three of your things. I, I, <laughs> I, I wow. Okay, so. Thing number one, the cats themselves. Thing number two, the leash that attaches to your <laughs> chest. And thing number three, the Wolverine the... style bladed <laughs> exoskeleton that's of attached head. to a ring. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget yeah. the ring. <laughs> it goes around their body. It's uh, like uh, like underwear, but okay, in the middle of their body. What's your one-liner when you kill somebody with the cats? Oops. <laughs> That's good. I like oops. Every time, though? Oh, The yeah. third oops, you're like, I don't oh, like come it. Come on. He knew it was going to happen. He, so, he told the cat to do it. He said, cat, murder. You can't say oops after murder. <laughs> this is really poor writing. <laughs> Are you really? Deba- he has cats that have fucking <laughs> knives coming out of them, and they're attached to a ring. <laughs> I'm really on top on this ring. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, oops, oops. 
Man. Pooped again. Well, uh, <laughs> pooped again. <laughs> Oops, pooped again. Adult diapers. So, was there another question? Uh, there was. Uh, Dr. MC Jeff. Dr. Uh, MC Jeff. At heck underscore yeah. Oh, heck yeah. He said, yeah. heck yeah. He says he would bring a gun, a oh, knife. Oh, man. And a book full of one-liners for every situation. <laughs> now that is a man I can respect. Wow. Like, I feel like the one-liner is is the most important thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, definitely. Like, Absolutely. I, I, oh, man. I really One of know. my favorite jokes in any movie is when uh, Nick Frost's character exes Simon Pegg if he, if he said something cool after, <laughs> after he knocked somebody out. <laughs> He's like, no. Should have said that. <laughs> like that's that that movie is so good, but that's like one of the best jokes in it. I love that movie. He's like, but I did. Uh, you, I did say you need to freeze after I did this. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> I put him in the. I put him in the fridge. I said, cool off. Cool off. That's oh, what fucking nice. <laughs> Whatever he says, I fucking love. I need to watch that movie again. It's been like a few years. Uh, even the third one, which people didn't like, The End of the World. I don't like that one. At World's End. At World's End. You did not like that one, you said? <laughs> no. It, um... Cause I, I don't know. Because I love computers and going, you know... Oh, and the fact and that just, it ends with... He oh, destroys yeah. civilization, basically, and fucks... <sighs> it was over. a little too big, and it felt a little forced. You know what I mean? Yeah, because... Like, the, the first other- one is big, but, like... It takes place in a tiny exactly. area. You don't see like what's happening in America. Yeah, and then the second one is a town, which is kind of big, but like in the scope of the world, not that really. Big. But the third one, like, it's literally the end of modern life. Yeah, Damn. but at the same time, I guess it is a comedy. So yeah, I'm they pro- all end that way. Yeah, like Blazing Saddles. <laughs> <laughs> Keep bringing up the blazing sound. Oh my god. You want to show us some pictures, Al? Show us your fucking pictures. I'm going to show you some pictures. Nice. Ooh, doctor. From the fans, from the heart, it is RLF fan art. Beautiful Tommy gun. The sexy as hell. <laughs> Jeez. I want a super cut of all the beautiful Tommy guns. Oh my god. I be- think that be- would be, be- very beautiful Tommy Beautiful Tommy Gun. Beautiful, like, be- 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 Ooh, beautiful oh, Tommy you know how, like, a couple weeks ago we got that amazing song um, because of what the hell was what, what oh, um, say? Uh, uh, Toledo. 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 I want there to be like a uh, Toledo esque song, but it's just a super cut of the beautiful Tommy guns. Pew, 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 beautiful Tommy. Pew, 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 beautiful Tommy. Tommy. <laughs> beautiful Tommy gun. Bang. <laughs> they all, all, all uh, the songs and, and the bang, bang. Bang, bang. Bang, bang. bang. Baby. All right. Oh, that's... So, we have one from Nate. 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 Big Nate dog. Here comes Nate's picture. I was going to say Nate dog, too. Nate is a name that lends itself to Nate Dog. Yeah. Because well. you, you want some uh, second syllable in there. Yeah, true. So here we go. Uh, this is I think this is an animal we made up. Okay. Oh, the pooped. Oh, no way. Yes. No way. The pooped. I cannot believe that stupid thing. The Northeastern pooped is a violent bear snake hybrid creature. With the ability to make you forget long periods of time. It's said their venom is used to make roofies. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> that albino people put in drinks. Just al- what? Bill TCM reference, by the way. Oh, okay. <laughs> so the Northeastern Poomt? Yeah, it's... It, I Look at that horrifying face. And I love the googly eyes. Like a bear uh, snake face. It's got that... It looks like a heart. It's great. Yeah. It looks like the face is kind of like fighting against itself. There's a beautiful runtime error too. <laughs> um, and it, and it's purple too. Well, it's hard to say. 
Does, oh, does it does it change camo? No, but nobody's ever remembered seeing it. So. Oh, right. You're right. So speculation. Speculation. Horrifying. Totally. <laughs> speculation. I tripped my pants when I saw this. I hate that. <laughs> Why do you hate it? I don't actually hate it. No, I know, but I just, <laughs> I'm so happy with it. Boom. It's very rare that you have a word that has an M, a P, and a T all <laughs> next to each other. I can't think of another one. Can you? No. Because they shouldn't be. <laughs> <sighs> well, thank you very much, Nate. Thank you, Nate. That was great. Sorry, I rhymed. <laughs> Nate, great Nate. Oh, that's better than Nate Dog. Great Nate. The, great Nate, Nate the Great. What's oh, Nate the Great? Oh, shit. Nate, Nate the Great. You're Nate, welcome. What bud. about uh, Nate? If, were, if that's new to you, you're welcome. If you heard it before, go fuck yourself. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that's a very, clo- I've got, very broad distinction. I've got no middle man. <laughs> it's one or the other. You with us or against? And it's not his fault if he's heard it before. Yeah. No. But, Someone's just but, said it to him. But you're gonna have to forget. And go fuck yourself. Oh. Uh, next up, we got uh, Vault Cat Boy. <laughs> uh, hey, it's been a while since I did some fan art. I have still been listening to the podcast, but was too lazy to take a picture of whatever I drew, then send it in to you guys. It's a two for one because I didn't want to send two pictures and risk one of them not being shown because I don't know to email. Um, um, okay. Nikolai, I'm not about to start shit with you like everyone else, apparently. Thank you very much. Just keep rolling with the punches till we launch the counterattack. Oh. Mm. Oh my god. Oh no. Are you saying that you're going to draw some uh, fan art of conspiracy? What's the counterattack? I don't know. I mean, would that not be the counterattack? Is mm-hmm. to draw fan art of conspiracy? He's planning something. I don't believe him. Conspiracy storming the beaches of Normandy with Kermit the Frog. That would be weird. <laughs> Just the two of them? When do we come to Kermit podcast? Uh, about like three or four weeks. I mean, the walls are green in here. Oh, shit. Oh, my God, they are. <laughs> shit. They became the Kermit podcast long before we realized. We've been setting ourselves up for this for years. <laughs> yeah, it's not going to end well. It's not going to end well. Um, Vault Catboy continues. Um, uh your fat friend, a.k.a. Vault Cat Boy, Robert Breach. Oh, Vault oh. Cat Boy. Uh, BT Dubs, I'm still stuck in your house eating your food. Could you leave a key or something so I can get out, Al? I'm sick of eating Chub Burgers. Wait, you need a key to get out of the house? Mm-hmm. Yeah. How, do you, how does your house work? When you uh, go inside, you lock all the doors, and then when you want to leave, you have to unlock it. Oh, so like the way a, like a, a murderer's would. I guess. Yeah. Or, yeah. or secure home. Yeah, he's going for a very Dahmer vibe. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah, I definitely picked up on that. You ever seen Fright Night? <laughs> he's a big fan of the vampire. He likes the villain in that movie. First clue should have been the flesh covered <laughs> lamps. <laughs> he said they were authentic and he got them somewhere. They smelled authentic. <laughs> yeah. I thought maybe he killed a raccoon, but. No, that was a person. <laughs> it was a real bummer when I figured it out. It was more of a bummer when I figured out how long it took me to figure it out. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> I'm a moron. Um, so Let's see these pictures. That's right. Let's yeah, do Bullcat it. Bullcat boy. Let's go. Two for one. Oh, man. Two for one. Look at that oh, windmill. Oh, damn. That's crazy. Look that. at that windmill. Look. This is great. Whoa, damn. What? I love kinda, that mouth. That's a crazy ass tree? Man, I wish that was like a little, just a sound bite. That we. <laughs> just, oh, I, love man. Wow. I love that mouth. <laughs> I love that mouth. I love that mouth. Well, now he's got you too. Oh, no. <laughs> it's worth it. <laughs> uh, oh, there's a wanted poster? I think that's me. Someone with a mustache. I don't know how you'd be able to tell if that's you because it's a circle with two dots. But it's a pretty awesome wanted poster. You can clearly see uh-huh. the intonation of my face. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, that's, that's absolutely your nose. I'm, I apologize. That is your nose. 
That could not be anyone else's no. nose. That definitely one hundred percent looks like an owl. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, maybe it also could be an owl. <laughs> it could oh. be an owl. I'm not gonna discriminate. You know what? I'm on team owl now. I want an owl to get in that tree. Here we go. Uh, we have. Is that who's? Is that me with the scar? I don't know. Oh, you have a cat belt. That could be you. You know what? Let's say that's well, Nicola. Isn't that this, ball arms right there? This is ball arms, but it's a backwards hat, so it's that's Sage. Is it Sage? Isn't the little thing at the bottom Sage? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's Sage. But, but then there's another. There's a wanted Sage too. I like my stubby legs. They're very low groin. <laughs> In my old, in, in, in the few years. I'd like my low groin. <laughs> in my later years in life, I'm going to have a problem with, like, scraping my balls on the ground. You got a very Tyrion Lannister thing going right Oh, now. I do, I do. <laughs> that tree uh, is still fucked up, though. This, yeah, that uh, tree is screaming. This, this, that Cyclops tree is pretty great. Do uh, you think he's upset because Sight's defiled it? Probably, and yeah. stupid Sage was here nonsense and his backward ease. <laughs> there, there is a poster. Mm-hmm. Alright, well, alright. This guy says... Yeah, what does his hat say? It says, it's a hat. Nice. Now, this guy does have a tie. So, is this a possible hands That's hands? hands? I was going to say a hands beat, but you're right. It's a backwards hat. So, that's a, that could be a slippy tans. And then, um, there's also a missing poster, which very much looks like Sage. Another wanted poster. And it says, wanted... And then, and then it says he's really fucking stupid. Oh wow! <laughs> oh, Jesus! I mean, that's one way to catch somebody, I guess. Insult them. I'll show those motherfuckers. Oh my God! Could you imagine if there was like it? We're in the old west, mm-hmm. and it's like, oh, we can't catch skipping the boys. Like they just keep robbing all these stagecoaches. I don't know what accent that is. But uh, I, I start as the sheriff. I'm like, I got a great idea. Put up a bunch of wanted posters of Skip in the voice. And I just like, just poke them. Like these stupid fucking morons with their small penises. <laughs> <laughs> Can't rob shit. <laughs> I object to the small penis thing, sheriff. <laughs> you need to take these posters down and place them somewhere now. But like... They get so offended that they want to kill the guy who made the posters, <laughs> yeah. and then I get to catch him. Yeah. It's a perfect plan. It really is. I don't see how it could go wrong at no. all. No. You're good. extremely insulting sheriff. Sure. Could you imagine if, like, in printed in time, you had, like, one of those wanted posters <laughs> that could save the Smithsonian? And it's like, you bunch of no-nut-haired cunts, the bitch. <laughs> Just not even... Good. Cuss it out. <laughs> Wanted. Steve Smith gang. For stagecoach robbery. Bank robbery. <laughs> Known for his <laughs> blonde hair, blue eyes, and inability to please a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Emotionally. Sexually. Even during a conversation. He can't do anything. Also, what is with that underbite? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. I think he's got very ladylike fingers. <laughs> yeah, Who's you're... talking about my fingers, <laughs> sir? <laughs> sir, I, I have got to draw a line. <laughs> I cannot please a woman. <laughs> but my fingers are very manly. <laughs> so do we have another uh, fan art? Yeah. We do. All right. Let's take a look at another picture. Thank you very much, Vault Cat Boy. Yes, thank you very Appreciate much. Appreciate it. This is cool. I like this. I like both of these. Thank you for sending both of them. In. I do. I like the gnarly trees in both of them. The gnarly trees. I, like I the also like the way they make me feel. They give you the tinglys. Yeah. You make me feel. Uh, this one's from a little bro. Ooh. Are little you serious? Bro. We haven't had a little bro in a while. It's, it's a fo- been it's a, a minute. It's a Photoshop. Oh, no, pretty, no, it's fine. Photoshop. Okay. All right. Um, as long as it involves neither Hitler nor Kermit the Frog. All right. We we're good. We'll see. No, don't worry. Oh boy! So uh, apparently this is exactly. this is from Archer, or something. Okay. <laughs> but uh, little bro just pasted Seitch's, uh face. Oh, that's the leg picture. Fa- that, if that, if there was one thing from our group of friends that could go viral, I would want it to be, to the be leg, that picture. Oh, leg picture. Oh, absolutely. Oh, oh my god! Not, if it could be like an episode of RLF or like one of our videos now. 
I would that want that picture leg picture. of Sage coming out. I would want that to be as famous as the Tom from MySpace picture. Oh man. Like one of the most recognizable images in the world. <laughs> wow. That would be ridiculous. It's just so good. It's it's so it's such a perfect amount of creepy. <laughs> it's, it's... And he's just coming out of the <clears throat> reflections. <laughs> Makes me laugh at how ridiculous it is. Uh, I love, I love, oh man, I almost, I almost gave him a perfect line there. I love what it says on the plane too. Oh, I bet you do, big boy. <laughs> Were you gonna say I love dick sex? Go on. <laughs> oh shit. Yes, exactly that. Man, I want. To send that to him. Oh, I thought you were gonna. I thought you were just gonna say I want and then pause. <laughs> and wait I for want. me to read dick sex again. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to throw things. That was Scottish. <laughs> you uh, don't know. That's. Oh, I don't, that was, that, I don't the, know what that was. Yugoslavian. Yeah. <laughs> don't know. Don't know. That was like a little bit of Jamaican. <laughs> <laughs> so we, do we have uh is that was that the last fan art? Was uh, that... no, actually we have uh, one from uh <coughs> conspiracy. What? Oh, nice. Oh my Let god. Let me guess. I'm Yamcha again and I've just gotten Tuchis raped by uh, We can only hope Vegeta. And... Yeah, no, that's it. Yep, yep. That's great, actually what great. Really looking forward to this picture. Yeah. It's gonna be great. Conspiracy. All right, guys. Here's a multi-person fan art. Ooh. Lucian started editing this, and then I added a few bits. And the other RLF fans gave me suggestions. And Atlas the Great and Burger Bro suggested I do quotes. Shout out to three to J Chris Paul, not a three, for the idea of harnessing RLF quotes. Not trying to steal your thunder, J Chris Paul. I promise. <laughs> Goofy laughing face. <laughs> I, just, I just want to point out that because of my shitty eyes. On screen, I was trying to read along, and I thought it said, Shout out to two cripples. Oh, <laughs> my, oh god. my god. Jeez. Which two? <laughs> they know. They know. They <laughs> do. Um, so here's well, your... Is, look, sounds awesome. Uh, yeah, no, this is going to be great. Here's your multi-fan fan art. One of these will just be the picture by itself, and the other one will contain the quotes. Uh-oh. Just in case you want to look at the picture without all the text clutter. From the fans with love and occasional bitchy vitriol, enjoy hearts. Wow. There we well, go. Well, damn. That is sick. That's friggin' great. Hot dog. That looks Hot. so... I'm, like, I forgot we're supposed to keep talking. That looks so, so good. That looks like an album cover. It's if it didn't have the quotes on it, that would definitely... I mean, I love it with the quotes, even though we haven't read them yet. I'm sure they're funny. Because we said them. But... but uh... <laughs> <laughs> no, I definitely could see this as, like, as... Just the front. It's even 19 a- quotes, too. That's a perfect amount of tracks. Yeah. Ooh. Even at a quick glance, it's mostly Al. So, all right. <laughs> <laughs> even at a quick glance. Um, Matt, do you want to uh, uh, sure, I'll, pick I'll, one I'll... of these that are me? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Uh, or there's... I turn into a chicken when I say my name. That's why I don't say my name. Al gets telekinesis. <laughs> telekinesis. <laughs> Telekinesis. <laughs> Al gets <laughs> telekinakadig. <laughs> Al gets telekinesis. Ooh, I could juggle now. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you did with telekinesis. <laughs> what? If- <laughs> I juggled. Yeah. And that's how I met the man on the fish. I'm Billy Joel. Yes, I remember that. It was more sing. And that's how I met the man on the fish. I'm Billy Joel. Oh, um. Wait, you gotta go to the left a little bit. Eat butterflies. Oh. <laughs> that's- Eat butterflies. Ow. Don't. Man. <laughs> I got stabbed in Cancun, Nikolai. I do not remember. I do not remember saying that. Uh, it's been a while. Literally, all of them, numerous times. 
<laughs> um, I'm here to harden your nipples. <laughs> if you shave your butt hair, then when you sweat, it doesn't get caught in the hair. You just get swamp nuts. It's true. Wow. Get swamp nuts. Um, what are love, Nikolai? <laughs> <laughs> what I <are> love <laughs> What I <are> love <laughs> um, How is math? Oh my god This is drunk math Oh boy uh, Nikolai I don't want to don't, don't read it Oh wait <laughs> yeah. Go ahead. What do you do? Says Nikolai. <laughs> oh wait. Oh that one. Oh, what do you do? Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were looking at the other one. Get that bird, pussy. <laughs> I don't. I, I, where, I don't think I said some of these things. <laughs> no, it was when we were, we're talking, talking about, about the Chloe. The Chloe wait, guys. Oh yeah. Hey, you should go. You get that bird, pussy. <laughs> I do like, like talking about bumping jennies. <laughs> Fish tank, Sage. <laughs> I wanted to cuddle with Matt. Ow. Do watermelons grow what? in naturally in the wild, or are they like Twinkies? <laughs> Wait. I remember saying that. We opened the show with that. <laughs> Is that what you were laughing at? No. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Top laughing. <laughs> it wasn't our weenie that ta- that tangled. It was his weenie <laughs> in a different <laughs> row while he was sitting next to his father. Ew. <laughs> I, I said that before. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think that was when uh, you were somewhere with Seich. Oh it was God. a side story. I think you were at a wrestling arena. Oh my God! I don't remember that. Um, I said no swastikas. I specifically said no <laughs> swastikas. swastikas that, Matt. that I remember. That was a few episodes ago. <laughs> um, Ugh, it's Kermit the Frog. Of course, it's the. How many people have heard me say <laughs> D? <laughs> <laughs> um. I think that's all of them. I think that's all of them. Yeah. Oh, wow. that was good. Wow. That was really well done. <laughs> and of course, the last one on the right, I don't know if you can see that, Matt. Let me on your team, I'll suck dick. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. I saw it earlier. I didn't want it to read it. Oh, that's all of them. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Shit, that was really funny. That was great conspiracy. Thank I think you. the best one is Fish Stank. Fish tank. Fish tank. Oh, and that's how I met the man on the fish. <laughs> I'm Billy Joel. Wow. Oh, okay. Shit. Um. <clears throat> let's uh. Let's look at. Let's let's look, pick some stickers. Uh, oh. Pick a sticker out. Oh my. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Where's that cup? It's right here. Sticker of the week. It's time for. Sticker of the week. You know what that sound is? Sound of grown men picking stickers up. My God. Two stickers. Two stickers. That's for you, Matt. All right, so this week I picked, ooh, Statue of Liberty. Ooh. And it says New York. And then, bam, a cool looking Nike shoe mm. of some kind. If I were a shoe head, I would know. No, I don't that's think a real. double wide twan engine filter. I don't think that's how shoes work. You know, they definitely don't have filters. We or bo- we filters. both said we don't know a lot about shoes. You're right. I you know what? I don't know enough to debate you. I just shoes, feel like you're wrong. Shoes could have filters. <laughs> they could have filters. What oh, am I saying? No. What did I get? Here, this one's for you, Matt. Ooh. Oh wait, I'm sorry. I didn't take the picture. God damn it, me. Matt, what'd you get? Uh, me, I got the. YouTube sticker. Oh my god. That's the best sticker. And a Gyarados. You you and your Pokemon. You, every you time I'm the Pokemon, Pokemon I'm, I'm, put, every week. I'm putting that one back. 
Okay, the Gyarados. I am, and and YouTube's going forward into the last round. All right, who's picking this week, Matt? Mm-hmm. I don't, I don't know. I think it should be Matt. Yeah, I think it should be Matt. All right, All right. Matt, this is for you. New um, York. New York, New York, New York, New York. What do we got out? I have a uh, Best Buy. Very exciting. Okay. Wow. And uh, proud sponsor of the podcast. Yeah, and Duncan Jordan. Yes, you have a uh, Air Jordan. Man, oh, shit. So I'm obviously gonna give Matt Air Jordan. Little Nikolai would definitely have to go with little jo- with uh, flying Jordan. Little Jordan, little, little Bill, jo- little Jordan. Did you, <laughs> did you hate the little Bill cartoon because I thought say it, that no. all the time? That wouldn't get it that much. And if uh, they not as much as Kill Bill, Kill Bill, I got more. Yeah, that makes sense. more from dads. Oh yeah, that makes a lot. Of, yeah, I remember Jim's dad, Captain Apathy's dad, saying it. I was like, one day you'll be dead, old man. <laughs> and then. <laughs> And then... I'll see you later. <laughs> <laughs> Matt. We're going to go with Air Jordan this week. Really? Air Jordan. Air Jordan beat out YouTube and New York, New York. It's the greatest city in the world. I agree. According to some. Well, then why do you... We don't have to throw it around. We're getting dunk. We're Act getting, like you've been there before. We're getting That's dunked true. on. Where is Jordan going? Jordan... Well, it doesn't get to Al get to place because it, it was his sticker, or do I get to place it because I oh, you no, place you, it? No, you place it. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, hey, Mr. What? Air Jordan. Mr. Air Jordan, what you doing to me? Uh, while uh, you Jordan. find a place for Mr. Air Jordan, oh, well, I think it'd be time to get Tommy Gun out here one more time and sing us in for some comments. Oh, shit. The video on YouTube have a place called the comment section where people can type out how it felt and thoughtful reflections of the videos they just watched like here at our left on Wednesdays now the gang will read a few it's really hard to rhyme the word Wednesdays alright so our first comment this week is from uh, Dark Matter Ooh, oh, D-R-K-M-A-T-R. Dark Matter. M A T R. It's lowercase T though. That's important. Mm-hmm. Um, dark Matter says bacon back bitches is great, but I think college lobster creatures is a close second. I gotta be honest. College lobster creatures made me laugh. I giggled on that one. <laughs> that's a, that's I like a good college one. lobsters. <laughs> college lobster creatures. <laughs> I could definitely see that being like um, the fake college names. In a Rodney Dangerfield movie in the 80s? Yeah, 100%. Oh, man. Just like, in the background or something. Absolutely. Like, oh, my God. We're going to state. We're going to face the Mississippi college lobster creatures. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why Mississippi lobster, not Maine? I don't know. Right. Hey. Why are they, how are these creatures different from just standard lobsters? <laughs> I really need to know this. Well, they're Mississippi Because we're talking lobsters. lobsters that can fly. It's over, Johnny. Ooh, no thanks. <laughs> Why? Because, I mean... Because if I need a... What? No. <laughs> <laughs> Their greatest weakness is that they're slow and kind of confined to the water, but not really. So if they weren't confined to the water, how would lobsters gain more... I mean, I understand that if they're like, if you didn't see them coming, like, oh, shit! <laughs> But like that Holy would apply fuck. to most like most flying things. Like lobsters are. It would pretty... just be creepy. It would be creepy. It wouldn't really matter. It's I guess. too big to be flying. I would be startled it's, by its size. It's still like it can't. It's not. Well, how fast. would it? How would it fly? Which creature would become the would worst based on flight? Around well, then it? spiders. Would it have a ring? A ring. <laughs> you know that's a callback. <laughs> 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 Oh yeah! No yeah, one's yeah. here to say get fancy. I know that's true. That well, that hasn't been here for many, get, many years. But, I know, uh, but I miss it. Here, that's true. Get fancy. <laughs> it's, not, it's not the same. Not, no, I don't know how the hands of yeah. get <laughs> fancy. Um. Yeah, but so thank you, Dark Matter College Lobster Creatures. College Lobster fan. Creatures. Yeah, that's Has. great. Um. <clears throat> Fred Bob, 392. Well, Fred Bob, you got two names. Fred Bob, uh, if anyone on the podcast were to have a lobster fetish, it really would be Nikolai. I don't know what the deal is with lobsters this week. Man, there's a bunch about lobsters. a lobster-centric uh, episode. I want to make it very clear, I hate all seafood. 
It's disgusting. You hate all? I thought you didn't... You, or uh, like fish sticks. I, I mean, that doesn't count. Do you I, like tuna? I, can, I No. Ugh, okay. No. I can fuck with... Uh, <laughs> shrimp. I can fuck with some I sandwich. Fuck with I don't shrimp. really fuck with cheese. <laughs> I forget what comedian that is. That's a great... His, his bit is, I curse too much. Mm-hmm. He's like, I know I do, because the other day I told my doctor, I don't really fuck with cheese. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, I need a better vocabulary. <laughs> I sound like a fucking moron. <laughs> it's pretty good. Oh, that's great. <laughs> um, I forgot what I was saying. But um, no, as far as... Um, Seafood goes? No, that's it. No, no shrimp. Seafood. And I've I've definitely said this many times. Sea uh, shrimp for me is a tartar sauce delivery system. It is not okay. about the shrimp. All right. And shrimp has almost no flavor. It really doesn't. I've had your fucking lemon zest. You're all be you're all eating bad shrimp, man. I've had. You a, do need. It, what, is it the crust can't get it frozen? There is there is actually can't get it frozen. Shrimp. If you can get it fresh shrimp, mm-hmm. I don't think I've ever had. Shrimp that wasn't frozen. Shrimp, th- shrimp frozen is l- guys, literally bland. Guys, it's, yeah, uh, yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Let's go to a fancy Italian restaurant, okay, and get shrimp. Is I mean, I've be- had like it shrimp- depends on the restaurant. Let's go to you just go to a, you just go to a, a f- like a place that sells fresh fish. Oh no, thank you. You Wait. know why? Because it stinks like fish there. Wait, what are we... And I don't like that. What are we getting again? Shrimp. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the way I said it? <laughs> A little bit. <laughs> shrimp. Shrimp. I don't know if it's... Was it, was it that you forgot? Or was it the way I said it? A little bit of both. Because <laughs> nice, okay. uh, okay. I thought we were talking about sam- like big bass. And then I was thinking of bass, <laughs> bass flying. Because we were talking about lobsters flying. Big, and ba- big bass flying. Here goes big bass. And like a bunch of big bass would fly by. Ooh, what is more startling? A flying bass or a flying lobster? Matt. Still lobster because like it has yeah, claws. claws. Lobster, Duh. Yeah. You're right. Stupid question. I, no. I'm kind of embarrassed. Next comment. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> no. I was gonna ask, uh, what animal or creature mm-hmm. could you kill? Is the scariest given the ability of flight? Like, oh, what creature shit. becomes awfully terrifying if it has wings? Because, like, you say spiders, but then bears. See, I'm gonna go with a practical <laughs> answer. Yeah, G- like. I'm going to say, and it's so almost, it's stupid, but like elephants or a humpback whale. Anything that's enormous. That'd be majestic. Just because like, if that, if that thing eats it, it's like, ah, heart attack. Like, it's just falling. Yeah. Could you imagine? It's Cause true. like. I've seen birds fly into a window. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Imagine Man. humpback whales. Just, oh, we lost part of Illinois today. <laughs> the Sears Tower will be missed. <laughs> The giant dead whale, <laughs> but it didn't like. Imagine like it didn't actually go, so it's like still dying. On oh the no! Oh, oh my god, it's terrible. <laughs> or is it something small? Is it something small and terrible like scorpions? Oh, that's fucking. Di- Could you, you walk into your car? <laughs> you're, just, you're just like, oh, what's up? It's Monday. That kind of blows. <laughs> oh, oh, it's way worse than just Monday. No, it's Monday with a scorpion. See, it's it's this this is a hard question. It's a um, hard question. I uh, yeah, flying, that's a, flying rattles. Those are all horrifying. Anything that answers lives on the ground in Australia flying would be oh deadly. My God. Yeah. yeah. Um, monkeys. I mean, I would just would they be wearing the suits from the Wizard of Oz? No. <laughs> But if we it, can only hope. We can try. <laughs> uh, let's see. Our next comment comes from uh, Novaco. Novaco. Which would be company. So Nova Company, I guess. Nova Company. Novaco writes in, just for clarification, Monica says so. You got it, Novaco. Whatever that means. Uh, <clears throat> Nova, I must say, I don't like being drawn as Al, even if it is for fan art. P.S. Sorry for my shitty handwriting. Uh, so this was uh, in reference to one of our fan arts from last week. Yes, correct. Yes. Um, P-P-P- I think it's P 
PSS? PP. I think, I think it's PPS. PPP. Oh, okay. Which is What's the PPP? P- 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 yeah, no, it's BC. <laughs> uh, it's BC and then BCC, uh, but it's PS P- PPS. PPS. Yeah. Post postscript. Right. Poo-poo. Um. PP. My IRL name. Oh boy, hold on. Did you just hit me with a poo poo pee pee? Uh, you know, maybe I did, Matt. <laughs> maybe I poo poo pee pee. <laughs> I R L. Did it. I did it. <laughs> My I R L name. Fuck that, man. Just say in real life. It's the same number as syllables. No, but, uh. Now, now they don't have to deal with N or E or A. Yeah, but we're R L F. Yeah. So we short. We're sh- Fuck that. Anyway. <laughs> Novico, <laughs> in real life, my my name is in fact not Monica. My God! But it is Dale. Just throwing it out there. I don't believe you. I'm Dale? gonna believe I don't Dale. Think that you're Dale. I believe Dale. Do you? I do. Do you? I don't. Do you want to read the top comment? Uh, the yeah, I do. For the week is uh, Dale. Um, I do. You think that Novico is Dale? Yes, I believe them. I don't. Fine. I think it's Steve. That's two out of three. That's Two out of three don't believe you, Novico. We need proof. Send us your ID and your social. Nice try, Steve. Yeah. <laughs> don't do those things. This uh, last one. <laughs> don't do those things. This uh, last one's from Conspiracy. Um, Conspiracy says, all right, I just have to add, I have the RLF playlist going while I'm drawing, and hearing Matt read off an overly descriptive fan fiction of Saich and Nikki making love genuinely made me sick to my stomach. Yeah, me too. <laughs> written by oh, a g- written by a ghoul with no name, I believe. Excellent writer, but probably really needs some fucking therapy. <laughs> Laughing smiley face. Well... well Oh, sorry. sorry. By all means. Wow. We just we literally. Did. That's um, what it feels like to be such. <laughs> oh, it's so warm. Is it? And still so cold. <laughs> <laughs> Everything kind of sucks. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, yeah. My favorite part of uh, of those. Erotic fan fictions between Nikolai and Seitz <laughs> was uh, when they stopped. <laughs> I liked, I liked them. Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> oh my god, that's right. I remember we used to make you read them. Yeah, that's right. Hey, it's look, not good. I'll read them next time. No, they're not. Uh, we're, we're not asking <laughs> for. We're not. No, thank you. <laughs> Keep them to yourselves, everybody. <laughs> also, conspiracy. Want to touch on the Nikki thing again? Don't. That's not my name. So I just wanted to clarify. Uh, I just wanted to touch on it real quick. Mm-mm. Yeah. So thanks. And I also wanted to bring up last week we had asked you to start writing and choose your own adventure. The whole thing. Not so, here yet, I guess. <laughs> it hasn't even been like a week. I think, I think at this yeah. <laughs> The point of us recording this has been like six days since you could have known. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, where's your email? No, um, uh, I saw in the comments that you had uh, you were bouncing off some ideas that we didn't know how we were going to actually pull this off. Right. Uh, I think we're going to try and jump into the 20th century and have get you a um. A, a jet a ski. A beeper? No. Oh. Okay. A jet ski? Yeah. And then she could ride here. A wave runner? Yeah. You can't you can't frown on a wave runner. You can't no, with that a attitude, wave rider to the moon. Yeah. You can try. You can die. <laughs> uh, no. Um, we're going to figure it out as far as... Video call? Yes. Or uh, audio call? Uh, one or the other. One or the other? Only yes. one. Only... <laughs> either only video or only audio. <laughs> they can't be mixed. No. If we have mixed... Uh, it's we'll too like much. That. No, I'll hate it very much. So I'll have to see things and listen to them. Yes. Yeah. So uh, I imagine. Uh, uh, <laughs> Al. Yes. We'll be, uh, uh-huh. I, I gotta imagine you're gonna be emailing to get her number. Uh, yes, I will get. Because I have you conspiracies n- phone number for us. Internet to... number. Internet number. That's what we're gonna do. Our internet number is different <laughs> than <laughs> phone numbers. Yes, they have a. Uh, uh, cats in them. <laughs> oh, my number's eight uh, cat four one two. I'm exactly. a thousand years old. Nine cat four cat seven. 
You look great for your age, Nikolai. Yeah, I feel I don't I don't feel like I do. You don't feel like you're a thousand? No. Well then that's great. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I, I feel so old. Mm-hmm. And yet time seems like it has never passed once. It feel, like I uh, so but by that I mean this. I work with a lot of young people. Okay. okay. And it is just like there's no way I was like that. Oh. But I was, and it wasn't that long ago. Mm-hmm. But now I couldn't imagine being like them. No. All the time? Yeah. Ugh. I don't know what they do. <laughs> they, uh, they're they just, just all very... horned up. You just want to fucking drink and have fun and yeah, make memories like... and kill. <laughs> <laughs> doing what you should be doing with youth, what we did yeah. with youth. And if you don't want to, like, be vulgar and fucking drink and uh, you want to do other stuff, like, Figure out who you are and play chess and drink. Drink. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, at the end of the day, we're all just trying to fuck, right? <laughs> if we can't fuck, we drink. <laughs> That's yeah. Yeah. Think about everything. <laughs> Why not? <don't... laughs> we're getting existential. <laughs> no, no, fucking like, and drinking. Oh my like literally all of art exists because people want to fucking uh, smash. All of art, all of life. Yeah. <laughs> the only purpose to do anything yeah. is to keep going as a species. That's <laughs> true. And and when you're you know, a teenager, you're just figuring out like, oh, now I get to do those things. Yeah. So let's fucking do it. Let's fucking drink. <laughs> <laughs> There's a comma in there. Yeah. <laughs> I like the fact that like at the prime age when they're ready to make horrible decisions and they are horned up as shit, it's the perfect time for everybody to collectively go, see ya, here's your first time without any sort of leash or control. Yeah, right? <laughs> Good luck. I'm going yeah. to go hurt, ship you off to like a, just a big barn of people your age. <laughs> They're going to corral barn. you <laughs> to maybe four to a room. I don't know. It's like the maze. Don't running. worry. It's not co-ed. <laughs> yeah, the boys' room's right here. Yeah. The girls' room is right here. So nobody's bumping Jenny's, all right? <laughs> I told the boys they were going to the Hunger Games. Instead of college? No, the camp that you guys were talking about. We were talking about college. Could you imagine the Hunger Games is a fat camp? I mean... (sighs) That'd be a great fat camp. For adults, even. I think think it'd be better for adults. Because you get hungry. But wait, do we die? No, no, no. You get get shot... (laughs) That's not a great fat Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. So, like, it's all, like, paintball, I guess. Yeah. And you get, and people hunt Paintball and Nerf weapons. Yeah. Oh, man. That's a great idea. Let's do it. This summer. style, all paintball. Well, maybe not not this summer. Next summer. Or some other summers later. During a summer. (laughs) (laughs) Not winter. (laughs) We are not... The only thing we are committed to <laughs> is the season. <laughs> I'm just picturing the commercial. Do you want to lose weight? Come to Hunger Games Paintball Fat Camp. When? A summer. <laughs> Three question marks on the screen. When? But the sun is out. <laughs> Someday. Not Sunday. Want to be clear. <laughs> People keep showing up. How much? I don't know. Hi, I'm Nikolai. I'm the owner of Paintball Hunger Games Fat Camp. Yeah, that's a long title for a business. But I wanted to let you know up front what we're about. It's making shoes. So far, we've really only been able to fund the commercial. Uh. But my dream is just to basically get a bunch of fat people in the field, have them shoot each other with paintball guns, and pay me a lot of money. And film it. Of course I'm going to film it. Oh my god. Oh, I just have a super cut of people falling down, but it's clearly not like... like It's just not from the fat guy. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> There's a few that are clearly just old vines. Yes. 
<laughs> One of them is three stooges footage. <laughs> This is just a taste of the fun we've been having. (laughs) Real wartime simulations. It shows actual combat footage. Oh my god, it's just... No, 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 it's Saving Private Ryan. (laughs) It's the... It's the the D-Day scene when the guy has his leg blown off. It's just heart-wrenching. Oh, man. Oh, but you pay like your like someone to just Photoshop like a shitty donut in his hand. <laughs> Wait, in his hand or as like his blown up arm? Oh my god, around it. Around it? Yeah, like around the blown up arm. <laughs> he's got like a tourniquet made yeah, out of a donut. He's in fat camp, so he's eating a donut. Oh man. What's... It wasn't good. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <coughs> all right, that all right. Was so funny. That was pretty great. And uh, conspiracy. Really looking forward to what you write. Want to be clear about the Nikki thing again? Don't. Mm-hmm. So whenever we get it, I mean, eventually, I guess. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So uh, I I love facts, and I brought some more facts. You oh, did. Wait, more facts based on the facts from last fact time that you handed I us. I don't even know. I, I don't even remember. You just got a bookcase of facts. We didn't read these last night. These are different facts. These are different All right, let's, facts. Let's go of course with these. we didn't read them last night. Well, we didn't read them last week either. We, we haven't been... Read. We've been reading... All right, so same. I'm going to go ahead and read off one or two of them. I want you guys to go ahead and find like two of your favorites in the little snippet I gave you. All right. See if anything uh, gets you going. Um, I, I should have done some more research because I don't know if this is true, and I really want to know. Uh, and if we could get somebody to... Give us some more information in the comments section. Perhaps one of you when are hippos, a scholar. Yeah. Um, when hippos are upset, their sweat turns red. Hmm. That's pretty hmm. Uh, unbelievable. I don't know, like, I don't know how that would... Maybe because, like, they have shells. You know, they have that armor on their body. I don't even really think that sweat would have a color. Like, I thought it would just be kind of, like, like, clear, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I never thought about, like, what animal sweat is like. Well, I mean... That's weird. Well, it's probably red because, like, they're sweating, it... but their pores are clogged. But with, wait, like, are they, like, thing. dogs? Are they just, is it, like, in their they... mouth? Because, like, dogs don't sweat. They just breathe out of their mouths real hard, right? Right, yeah. Um. Here we go. They don't have true sweat glands. Instead, hippos secrete a thick red substance from their pores known as blood sweat, as it looks like the animal is sweating blood. Oh, that's pretty nasty. Hmm. <laughs> So, uh, I kind of want to see that. So. You want to see the blood sweat? Yeah, let's go to San Diego. What about the tears? <laughs> oh. Oh. Wow. God, nailed it again. Right here. The right kid. Here. Oh. That, felt, that felt right. Um, my last fact for this week is going to be Facebook addiction disorder is a mental disorder identified by psychologists. Mm. I mean... Mm, so like that people, hurts. It's people, people who, who are uh, addicted to Facebook. Yeah. That hurts. Would well, it hurts that that's a thing? Yeah. Well, I mean, I kind of get it. If people you think about, actually like, the, are like. No, I know, but that's. I I was I was watching this thing, and they were explaining why um, slot machines are so addictive, like what they are able to learn about you just from a slot machine, like what you'll the amount of money that you'll put into a slot machine or the amount of time you'll put like. The way you bet. And um, basically what I'm getting at here is that things like Facebook and other things like phone apps all do the same thing. Yeah. And that's similar to what Dave was saying, I think. It uh, is. The last time we actually recorded a Madcast. <laughs> yeah. you And I, I get where... I get where they're coming from on that. I found out Matt has another friend tonight. God things are damn weird. Matt. <laughs> I mean, I don't go and hang out. I haven't seen him not. in two years. That's right. Oh, wow. Can you imagine? That was fucking crazy. <laughs> What's his... Let me see your phone. <laughs> let me see your phone. How, how do you talk to him? <laughs> Naked? Is it all bitmojis? Wait, so did you uh, finish a fact? Yeah, we did blood rhinos. Yeah, we, did we got blood. blood rhinos. We got the Facebook addiction disorder. That's Have you right. ever been addicted to a, uh, a, a a website or an app or a, a phone game, anything? Uh, um, uh, I'm sure there's been video games that you've been like, 
you had to go to school and you thought about all day, like, oh, I can't wait to go home and play this video game. Mm. <clears throat> Before you played video games nine hours a day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Back I, when it was a fun well, I remember when I got my PlayStation 2 and, like, the first time playing through, like, Tony Hawk Underground and Underground 2, like... I would go to school because like, oh, all I want in this world. Yeah. <laughs> and all I want in this world is to be, go home and finish playing that career mode. Destroy scores. Oh. Destroy high scores. Yep. Uh, yeah, I'd say, I mean, Perfect Dark, I guess. Perfect Dark, like a video really? game, I guess. You were addicted yeah. to Perfect Dark? No. Oh. Fair right. enough. <laughs> um, <laughs> I was addicted to RuneScape for a little bit. What is RuneScape? RuneScape is a free-to-play uh, MMORPG. Mm. And it's also um, a, a crystallized uh, amphetamine? It is not. Okay. That is crystal meth. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I always get those two mixed up. RuneScape and crystal meth? Yeah. Okay. Huh. Fair enough. <laughs> um, one of them sounds like a bunch of letters, and the other one is a really hardcore narcotic. Uh, no, Rune's got Rune and Scape. Oh, all right. <laughs> um, RuneScape was a game that I played so often that I uh, started selling accounts. Ooh. What does that mean? Well, that's I just would making... level up an account and I would sell it. That's making money, though. You told me that before. Yeah. You're doing work. I was making money. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, just selling. How much money did you make for one account? For one account? My highest account sold for 260 Jams. So what would what does that mean? Someone would receive the password and, and then a be cat name and password able yeah. to play as the character that you had leveled up. Right. And I then would, since the level was so high, they could just do whatever they wanted in the game. Right. I would make a spoof like Yahoo email. <coughs> I would make a new account under that email. Farts would, one. Right. right. Yeah. Level the account up, and then I would hand over everything to that other player. How do you? How would you sell that? eBay. Wow. Huh. Do you want anything on eBay? It's true. I mean, that was maxed out character, though. I never got anything close to that again. So it was top. It was top shelf. Ooh, that's crazy, though. I couldn't imagine buying a video game character. Oh, shit. People spend hundreds of thousands every month on World of Warcraft money hmm. through yeah, websites. I mean, that probably pales in comparison to League now, right? Oh, well, League of Legends makes... Yeah, their money's legitimate, though. Those sites for, like, WoW Gold and stuff aren't supposed to exist. But League of Legends, just through its own regular store, pulls in. Hmm. They made a billion dollars last year. A couple billion, maybe. Holy shit. Yeah. So they're going to build That's a, a free-to-play game. That game costs nothing to download and play. And they made a billion dollars. And they made a billion dollars last year. Oh, wow. That is crazy. Um, I learned today that uh, Nintendo used to be a playing card company <coughs> before the 60s. Yeah. So they made Damn. playing cards? Yeah, they stuff. made a popular Japanese uh, playing card that I do not know how to pronounce. Uh, what is it? Pinoki Doki? Pinoki Doki. <laughs> I don't think it's Pinoki Doki. All right. Uh, it could be Pinoki Doki. Matt, do you have a fact for us? I do. I, I have catch a your eye. Catch I your do. eye. I do. Two caught my eye, and these are both really, um, like, hmm. The 29th of <laughs> May is officially Put a Pillow on Your Fridge Day. Okay. okay. I believe that. I mean, it's they have a holiday for every everything. That's so nonsensical. I don't understand that. Exactly. And then down here... <laughs> Well, we should really do some more research before we just read <laughs> shit onto the internet. This could all be fake news, mm. like the Republicans are screaming about. The person who invented the Frisbee okay. was okay. cremated and made into a Frisbee after he died. <laughs> Bullshit. I'm gonna look That's it up. so crazy. I don't Matt believe it. Matt is going it. to fact check. I believe it. We need Dean Kane in here to go, do you believe it or not? <laughs> I think that's X Files, actually. That was definitely X Files. <clears throat> Did you know an eagle can kill a young deer and fly away with it? Wow, I I believe that a whole deer. Eagles are impressive and they're massive, huge. It's far, uh, what's scarier, a flying eagle? I know the answer already. Or a flying lobster. 
It's definitely an eagle, because, I mean, there's no way a lobster's yeah. flying as quickly as an no. eagle. No, that lobster is a goofy bitch. Yeah. He's going to be knocking into trees. He's not going to get through that forest. It's like one of his greatest dangers. He's going to try. Oh, he's going to try. He's going to get through. Yeah. But, uh, you know, I I wouldn't bet a silver boot on it. A silver boot? A silver boot. How about a golden boot? No, because he he's probably going to get through. Two nickels? Uh, no. Okay. Make it four. We got a deal. That's more money. All right. <laughs> um, do you have a one last fact? Uh, yeah. He, um, he was made into a frisbee, folks. <laughs> my what? God. He was made into a. Do frisbee. you have more information for us? Yeah. Uh, uh, shit. I Sorry. Guess. More words. Uh, no, it's fine. I have it. It's right here. Um, he died playing the game he loved. Wow. So he died playing frisbee. Okay. <laughs> he Boy. was cremated amongst a bed of frisbees. Wait. Absolutely. Um, what year did he die? I'm sorry, is that available? Uh, find out right now. The sure. y- he year died the while frisbee. playing frisbee. Yeah. From a stroke. Okay. Nice. Um, his name? Frisboy. Frank B. <laughs> <laughs> Steady Ed Hedrick was his name. Wow, okay. Wow, what a stage name. Uh, steady Ed Hedrick. Uh, did he, he earned his nickname from his uh, notoriously steady frisbee throw. My God, he threw it right through that dumpster. <laughs> could skin a cat with a frisbee. My God, he put knives on the frisbee. Cut my mother-in-law. Cut her? Good. Did, is she, did she die? Oh, no, she just got cut. Oh, good. She, she, uh, I mean, it's unfortunate that she got cut. Yeah, she's fine. She's a lizard person. Huh. You're really cool with that. That yeah, no, seems like fine. a big deal. It was at first, but I've gotten used to so it. So that means that your wife is a lizard person. No, they adopted. Oh, that's good. Yeah. That makes sense. Anyway. Adoption is the best. Frisbee was not the original name of the product. What was it? Can anybody guess what it was? Fubal. Nope. Fuck. Close. I don't no. know. Food. It was called the Pluto Platter. Oh. To capitalize on the UFO craze. Hmm. What, so this was like the 50s? When it, I thought 1957 the f- is when he wow. was approached by the wham Toy Company and c- they convinced him to sell the rights of the toys. That's when it was named the Frisbee. Wow. Wow. The Pluto Platter. I really would have assumed... I, I thought it was like from the 1800s. Because Marty was yeah. whipping that pie plate. Marty's fucking up the timeline. He really was. Singing songs he really he's was. not supposed to sing. It was named Frisbee. I mean... What all right? What um? So, 2015, I think, was the future year they go into. I should know yes, this. That is correct. If Marty from 2015, well, no. If Marty from 2018 went back in time to 1985, 1985 no, to get his parents to fuck, what song is he singing at the Enchantment Under the Sea dance? So he's singing a 2018 song or something like no, because. Marty sang, so we would be singing like. Okay, so basically you're saying, what would our Johnny be good? What would? uh, Yeah, like you would play Nirvana. If if yeah, okay. Okay. Um, What what are you playing for your parents? Man, that is really. I would I would like to say that I would play something cool, like Queen. Like I would just do. um, You have the ability, Bohemian Rhapsody or something. Try and pull that off. I don't think that that's exactly like a dance song at a prom by any means, <laughs> but that's the song nice. that came to mind. Maybe, maybe like the beginning. Mo- if you've never heard that song, Mama. Yeah, like you have a just piano. Just killed a man. They're what? Like, what? Put the a f- gun against his head. <laughs> Pulled my trigger. Now he's dead. Wait a minute. Let's I hope bump- you're all having a great night tonight. <laughs> Let's bump Jenny's. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, remember, teen pregnancy is a real problem. Yeah, use a condom. Geez. Life had just begun. <laughs> and then you've gone and blown it all away. Um, that would be... I'm just thinking of songs you could sing. Like, that would be awful. You make me feel like I'm living a teen oh my God. dream. <laughs> but your kids are going to love it. <laughs> oh, there's so much... Ba- I, oh, man, it'd be kind of cool if you did, like, Mr. Brightside. Oh man! Just losing your shit. Jealousy. 
<laughs> what is this? Yeah, they were that. I mean, you could really go nuts in the end half of that song. And <laughs> oh, what's the Black Keys song? Um, the one where the guy just dances. In I the do video. not remember. They were so popular for like fifteen seconds. What was everybody the band was again? a huge Black Keys. Black band. Keys. I, I feel like everybody really liked them, and then. Bam, God. Nobody liked them. Yeah. <laughs> Just nobody's talking about them. Hmm. Wonder why. <clears throat> what did they do? They're no arcade fire, right? <laughs> nope. God, I don't like that. Band. Ooh, you could fuck with them really hard. My Chemical Romance. <sighs> when, when I, I was, was <laughs> a young boy, <laughs> my father <laughs> took me into the city <laughs> to see a marching band. <sighs> Nobody oh. listening to this knows this. No, no that's not true. My Chemical Romance is cool. Fall Out Boy had a gr- like a number one song last year. Fall Out Boy is not My Chemical Romance. I, they're the exact like same genre of music. The, the, a lot of their stuff from the old days sounded really similar. Hmm. I li- I like both of those bands, and I'm sure that people who are like true fans of that music hate the fact that I just said that. But that's what happens with genres of music. They sound similar. Listen, I love ACDC. For the most part, a lot of those songs sound the same. <laughs> <laughs> it is very true. Like Mumbo Number no. Five sounds like Happy Birthday. That's true. What? Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> yeah, you know. One, two, three, Happy four, birthday. five. Happy birthday to you, all right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you all right? Yeah. That's pretty good. I worked in the birthday way too soon. It didn't. It didn't happen. <laughs> <sighs> All right, you sons of bitches! You're a son of a whoa, guys! Shh, calm okay. down! I'll, oh, I'm Stop. so angry! No, don't get angry, Matt. Why? You know what happens when you get angry, Matt? What, Matt? I don't know what happens. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. <laughs> Matt rips his shirt off. Your shirt. I'd be like, holy shit, dude! Don't rip your shirt off. I'd be like, I mean, if you're comfortable. What if I just turn into the Hulk? Start a rampage. If you fucking turn into the Hulk, <laughs> I run. Yeah, I would run. I'd run. And be like, oh my god, does anybody have a gun? Oh like, my god, it's not gonna help. It's the Hulk. Yeah, the other guy will spit it out. <laughs> I can't wait for that movie. And if I need a gun, I don't want to be there.